Hey guys, good morning. Well, this morning I went out to go and let my dog out on the run and I don't know if you can see behind me. You see how windy? It's really windy here today. So yeah, I went, ow. I went out to go and let my dog on the run and this is what I found. See the tree? It fell from the forest and on to my dog run. I don't know if you can see it, but see, it goes all the way down there, totally busted, and there's my dog run, and there's the tree. So now I guess what I have to do is try and figure out, because my husband is at work, try and figure out how I'm gonna get this tree off my dog run, because my dog needs to go out. It's a pretty good break too. We get some pretty gnarly winds whipping through here in Alaska. Hold on a second. Let me show you if I can get a better look at the tree. See that? That's a pretty good, pretty good break there. Let me see if I can zoom in. Yeah, that pretty much snapped in half. I don't know why or what made it so weak. Because it's a pretty healthy, strong tree. Looking down. I don't know. Oh, can you hear it? Let me show you guys. Yeah, it's gonna be a very windy day. Here in Alaska, when it winds like this, it usually, typically it means that the seasons are changing. Obviously the seasons are changing on us because the light has changed. Usually in the summer, it's kind of like a, it takes on a, you know, a summer hue, that warm orangey tone. I know it sounds weird to those who maybe don't live here, but in the winter time, our light changes and it changes to like a white, pure light. I don't know, it's hard to explain. I don't know why it does that necessarily. I'm sure there's some scientific term for it, but I ain't that intelligent. But um, yeah, so we got massive winds. Uh, so definitely seasons are changing here, which I'm kind of excited. I really like fall. Fall's my favorite season. What's your favorite season? So, and these dang bunnies, let me show you. See, bunny number one, Ooh, bunny number two. Oh, and my uh, my dump run. Gotta get ready for winter. Anyway, back to trying to figure out how I'm gonna remove this tree from my line. Yeah, how's that gonna happen? Maybe if I just pull on it? Let me see, how, how heavy is this? Oh, I'm gonna need a ladder. Oh my gosh, you guys literally under the tree right now. Probably not the most intelligent thing. I am backing up actually. Um, guess I'm gonna send my husband a, a picture saying, what do I need to do? I'll figure this out. Well, I don't know what we're doing today, but vlogging AK Missy style.
Okay, everyone, so it's not perfect, but at least I was able to use the loppers or whatever to get it back up off of the dog run line so that Ember can at least run freely. Here, I'll show you. Now it's away so that when she runs, at least she is not getting tangled up in leaves. That's just crazy. Okay guys, so we have another tree that fell, or at least a branch this time. So I'm wondering, I hope you don't have any more trees fall at night. We heard this one though, me and my son were in the living room and we heard it crack. And then I was like, oh, do you hear that? That's a tree. And we both kind of ducked on our couch and it, it wasn't, it was the tree I just showed you guys that fell. So thank goodness nothing have, has hit in the house yet. So I don't know, I'm hoping that it doesn't, I hope we don't have any trees that fall. Cross our fingers. Let's hope not. All right, guys. I think that this will probably conclude the tree vlog for today. We're not going to be able to cut it down until tomorrow. Well, maybe not. Maybe I'll show you tomorrow the taking down the trees. But do you hear that? That's all that went. Anyway. <sighs> okay. So you yeah, know about the fallen trees. And now we've got chainsaw. Now we're taking down some trees that haven't fallen but could potentially fall in the next windstorm. And then we're cutting up some of the ones that have already fallen. So, yeah. It's that dead one up there. Bigfoot in his natural habitat. No. <laughs> Stop putting me in this one. <laughs> you got the top part of the tree and it's mangled back there in those other trees. So it's going to be a little difficult to pull out. <laughs> All right, now we're moving to the backyard. <sighs> He's trying so hard to get it. All right. Oh, I get the one off the dog lead. All right. Yeah. Can you, Elijah, maybe get here? Move it out. Good job. Thank you. I really don't know how exciting this is for you guys. Oh my goodness. But this is a Alaska lifestyle, right? Unpredictable. <laughs> All right, guys. So we're going to finish this up. If you can't hear me, sorry. But uh, yeah. So like, subscribe, and favorite. I try and get vlogs up as much as I possibly can. Thanks, guys. <laughs>